Hello everybody, welcome back to Fjall Mod Season 3. Last episode we did another voyage with the Trump ship that came crashing down on us. Um, we're now moving on to the Ancient NG Cruiser created by Yoshi Gaming. There's a bit of a story to this, so uh, I'm going to put up the ship so we can already look at its glamour. Whilst we read a bit. I was exploring the recent rediscovered Crystal Sector Federation and found the remains of what looked like an NG ship. By using newly discovered technology, the ship has been restored to full functionality and is ready for its new maiden voyage. With crucial information, it could mean life or death for the Federation. Is it just me or that? Does that seem stupid? You're sending out a ship for its maiden voyage and you're already expecting it to get everywhere. I mean... Haven't you guys ever seen Titanic? After much very slow work on the ship and failing many attempts to get certain things to work, the ancient engine cruiser is finally complete. Ah, uh, this is uh, the building of. Okay. Alright. Um, I'm gonna get shot in the first mission. Ah, everyone uh, has been shot already, some people worse than others. For those watching on YouTube, we're talking about my XCOM series. On Twitch. All right, let's get this thing going. All right, hull beam, basic laser, this, this, and this. Okay. So it would be nice if we actually managed to get to the crystal sector once. It's been ages since I've been there. Um, yeah. For some reason, we start off with uh, missiles and drone parts. So sure. Reactor power will be more immediately useful. Hail them. Ah, Zoltan shields. You gotta love those. Uh, good old Zoltan shields. They're the best. And nobody can say any different because it's true. 80% dodge chance. They're doing a lot better than I am at dodging, so what up with that? Why is it always the iron that misses and the missile that hits? Is there some weird form of irony going on here that I'm completely missing on about? Or Thank you! Okay, bye Nighter. And by Styles RJ. Okay. Bit odd, you suggest me to play with a ship and I just bugger off. <laughs> uh, good stuff. Alright, bye. Okay. Uh, missiles, missiles, missiles. But at least no Zoltan shields. I suppose they're equally terrible at this point, unless this is a Lido, then in which case this one is actually the more dangerous one. What's gonna get dodged? Hmm, both of them. I am mildly surprised. One, two, three... Yeah, that's way too much. Hmm. Thought maybe I could have fired before that happened, but I didn't. Hmm. Well, see where this goes. We'll probably want to spend spend some time getting shields. That was going to be a bit costly. Uh, listen to their offer. We to the store. <clears throat> we'll never surrender to slavers. Hmm. 
Probably should have waited. Yeah. Well, this sucks. Well, this could be a short run as well then. Hmm. Shame. But that's kind of the new way of life, right? If things go bad, blame it on somebody else but me. Seems to be working all right. <laughs> uh, it's a terrible thing to say, but you know. Ah. I've restarted plenty of runs already, so... Not because I need to have that perfect start or anything, obviously I don't, but... I don't know, I, had, I started off doing this series, um, going off the fact that if I do a showcase of someone else's ship, they probably wouldn't appreciate it all too much if I would crash it before we got past Sector 1. S one of these ships that I recently did just completely threw it out the window, and now I don't really care too much anymore. So, you know, if you don't appreciate me crashing your ship uh, this early in the game, blame one of those ships that I recently played with. And if you don't, then hey, great. No problem. And I don't have to restart the runs over and over again. Hmm. I do vaguely wonder um on the thought process that some of these ships actually go through. Like, take this one for instance. You don't have shields, so you can dodge the first volley. With the weapon setup you currently have, you can deal one damage to enemy weapons. Which, face it, there are practically no ships out there that only have one bar in their weapons, meaning you're practically guaranteed to take damage with this one a lot. Now, that seems like a weird choice of design in my books. Alright, I'm not saying it's horrible or anything, clearly I don't, but it is an odd concept, isn't it? I don't know, maybe it's just me who thinks this is weird, but... Whatever, right? Um... I could be mistaken. Okay, we got level one shields. Which means it's probably in our best interest to we charging up all of the ions in the first attempt. You don't see that too often. Alright, well now that we have nothing to fear, might as well let everyone heal up right now, so I don't have to wait around in a bit. Doo -doo -doo. Hmm. 
Yeah, figured as much. Canoon, good. All right, do we have sensors? We do. Eh, they're almost dead. He's given up on life. Let's just wait it out a bit. They'll soon die. Wow, only one and it's still hit. Oh, good lord. <sighs> well, at least the cloak will make it so I don't get hit. Giving the shields time enough to recharge from uh, the ion damage there. Alright, so you guys are still not... Uh, still not suffocating. You gotta be close to it, right? You got it. There, there you go. Okay. Need all the scrap we can get, especially this early on. And let's go. Let's do NG. Why not deal with any more Zoltan shields? We got a store which we might be able to get something from. Probably a weapon of sorts. But that would mean we need some more scrap first. Which we are probably not gonna get. So we just get a weapon like that. Even better. All right, now you probably want to look at level two shields. Could go to store, sell. No, that's not going to be enough. Never mind. Two shields, and we get another flag gun. Weird stuff is happening, and I kind of like it. Well, we don't need to dodge, so we might as well do some other stuff while we just sit here and wait for things to happen. Nope. Well, that must have hurt. Hmm. But if you thought I heard my phone. I was wrong. Okay. Hmm. Um, yes. We got a shield charge booster. Not a bad augment. Nothing I would buy myself, but not a bad augment. Whole bunch of nothing as well. Burn. Hmm. Double flak won't be too bad either, but I think our weapons will suffice for now. Three shots instead of one. It's a bit of a difference, isn't it? We will not accept surrender. I could probably, yep, kill you. Hmm. 
All right, we are set. They don't lick up, so there's no point in jumping to that store unless I want to get into some really big trolls. NG Homeworlds, what can we get? We do have an NG. I don't know what we get from that. A weapon or something? I don't know. Don't know, don't know, don't know, don't know. Um, I got a human, right? Listen to their problem. Send your human crewman to communicate with the man. So the man is grateful to see another human and introduces himself as Robert Smith. He exclaims from a nearby human colony and would much appreciate being returned there. The colony is mining operations person that still fuel. Robert's family had engineers are excited to see him and are very grateful for his return. Apparently ran away to join the Federation Black like his older brother, but was never accepted onto a ship. So I can either get a Mantis or a Engines Upgrade. And it's one that's good on shields. Good, because that's where you're going anyway. <coughs> now, a teleporter is a thing that we need to look into. Because, one, we're playing against the baby flagship at the end of the line. Which is basically a pushover, I mean, seriously. And, on the other hand, we have a crystal, which is already a wonderful thing to have in any boarding situation. Good lord, what the hell is going on here? You're barging in, slamming doors? Good lord. Alright, come on. while for the air to go back in there, doesn't it? Alright. We have things to sell. Yeah, the system repair, but it's <clears throat> not that pressing, especially now that we're actually good for quite a while. Continue! Search some of your other stuff as well. Trying to run, are you? Well, it ain't happening. stuff. We should really beef up our engines a bit. Attack. It's only level one hack. It's a problem, sure, but it could be worse. Um, good, good, no problem whatsoever.
guy always has uh, a lot of shields. Hello, F F F3. If I mispronounce your name, don't take offense to it. I'm just not too well with names. Investigate station, storage, storage, for la, 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 la. yes, thank you. Um, we need power, yes. Yes, hello. There's just a gigantic delay. You're not hearing me, or? Hmm. Maybe I should... Uh, and hear my voice, or is the delay that bad? Uh, let's carry on in the meantime. Another system repair drone. Certain is coming from a small space, nor building another have a planet or satellite. Uh, we have an NG. Promise to help. Improved cloaking. Oh, yeah, that worker as well. NG crew remotely repaired its targeting system. Your crew member is able to remotely fix the glitch in defense AI, allowing the repair crew to close in and finish the job. This decision gives you its thanks along with a reward. Um. So 125 to get two more of those up. We should probably m set our weapons for the biggest part of the game. Mm. Just uh, keep going, I think. Got our store. No real need for it. I see Ferris now. Pushed will be out of supplies, but we could tell you of another secret base. Okay. It's a good thing that's for the next sector, though. Um, sure. I have an issue with running out of fuel. It's been a while, actually, so maybe I no longer have said issue. Yay! Um, Mantis Homeworld. Or civilian. Let's go Mantis Homeworld. Why not? Might not be a bad investment. A mantis ship invading us when hails you. Sparks fly about his carpet. You stay out as human, else you're next. What does it mean he's not really doing too well, is he? Aid. Now we're gonna use double flak here, it seems. Ah. Pick a wonderful room there, buddy. Well, fat load of good that did. That's better. Okay. <laughs> They're going for my doors, I mean. Irony. Um. Okay. Start going. Okay, then we move you here, move you here, move you here. <clears throat> Isn't it a bit early for them to already have level 3 shields, or am I really speeding ahead that quickly? I don't think we are, but feel free to tell me I'm wrong. Okay, attempt to contact. Welcome aboard. Uh, no, you're 
decent shield, so stay where you are. You can go man our doors. That's probably going to be worth more in a uh, mantis sector. Yes, I knew where we were. Stop talking to me. Uh, if I go here, then move to here, go here, move to here. I think I, we can then still hit up our quest. Mm, scrap arm. Fifty leaves me with ninety nine. Where are we anyway? Sector four. That's probably still worth it, right? And then we do one of these so I know not to forget about that. And we can go to yet another store. Surprisingly. Well, we're locked in because we want to do that quest. Um we can't teleport her, that's kind of it. Uh, okay. No, 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 no. You don't shields because I think I'm going to get a teleporter, so you might as well get. You know you're going to get replaced, so might as well do that. Attack the ship. Get this basic laser going as well. Extra shots, an extra shot, right? Indeed. See if I can put those flags together, just for no particular reason, actually. Because it looks cooler. There. That's my wonderful theory about that. Ha <laughs> ha, bomb failed. Sounded a lot worse. Alright. Boom. And then we just need one power bar for this. Okay, you two are not really doing anything important anyway, so once we are charged up here we'll be leaving hopefully before solar flare hits can wait as long as we have to or want to probably want to I'm not really planning on setting my ship on fire you know okay get waddling to med bay and we're gonna move on into another piece of misery Okay. Well, this could be dangerous, but... High hopes, right? Yes, we have high hopes. I can't tell the drone's down, but I'm going to assume that it is. We will not accept, and the drone is still up. Well, that's my bad. <laughs> of course, the weapon that's ready to fire is the one that gets taken out. My bad again as well. Didn't think I would pay for it as dearly as I am, though. But that's FTL for you, right? Are still ionized, can't have that. Let's get our butt out of here. Yep, 
into an asteroid field. All right. We're getting some uh, really <clears throat> tough ships. Then I get hit by an asteroid. Then again, asteroids don't give a damn about cloaking, do they? For them, this is all just a game. Why don't you go fix up the med bay? We're getting somewhere. I think we'll be fine for the remainder of this combat. Which obviously means I'm going to get hit in less than five seconds from now. Or not. Complaining for the win. Intruder on deck. Side with the fugitive. Fall damage. I wouldn't mind that our mantis on board, you know? But ah oh well. It wasn't meant to be. So that whole ship's full of mantis. Might as well put you guys on something so you don't get bored. Board Mantis is probably not good for your personal health. Who knows why the Mantis venture so close to the sun? Perhaps makes for a more fun challenge. Maybe so. those engines going. Could get out of here before the next solar flare, that would be great. Well, before the first, but it doesn't look like that's happening. Maybe it does? Yep. After long range beacon, we found charging and jump to the next sector. Sell six drones. Alright, now let's finally buy the power we need. Um. Well, we're doing quite well for ourselves, I must say. Level 3 shields, okay, sure, hull could use a bit of a tune-up, but... Other than that... We're not doing too bad. Uh, take the weapon. Got a chain eye on which we can now sell. We already have a crystal. The difference between one crystal and two crystals ain't really that big. And there's a crew teleporter. Can we get that? Yeah, barely. Yeah, sure. Let's get a crew teleporter. Alright, man, and it's a four slot teleporter. You should really mention that in your uh, forum post, you know. Sells for 10, and how much do we have to pay to do repairs? I don't know. We still got some hull left, so I think it'll be fine. If we get scrap here, we will go back to that store. Alright, how does that sound? 
We have time to register jump completion for your ship warrant. You have an incoming ship with weapons. Hot. Drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. And there is nobody. And there is someone in weapons. That didn't take long, did it? Um. Right. So I think we take down weapons and then use our beam to take care of that. Means they can't bring their dudes back from the dead. Which they just did, but you know. Uh. Now we don't have 100% dodge, which frightens me a bit. Okay, the missile didn't miss. They were waiting for us. We will not accept surrender. Instead, we are moving in ourselves. Doesn't look like they're aiming at something really important, so... What are you guys doing? What are you, what are you, what are you doing there? Ion bomb hits the engines, but their missile launcher is down anyway. be the weirdest ragtag team of boards I've had. A crystal, a mantis, and a rock walk into a bar. Is that not the start of a bad joke? Then I don't know what is, but we're going back to do some repairs. Okay. And our final slot will go to hacking. And we're dealing with mind control. And a bunch of bombs as well, it seems. We're gonna have to send someone out there. No need to take hull damage. Nope. I know the other one's gonna be an ion bomb, but no, 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 no. No fire bombs. I've been through too much. Okay, get going so you're actually... And that's just in time. Okay. Do we need power? Two, two. Yeah, we need two power bars. We want everything powered. We'll have to do with one for now. <coughs> Small AI ship. It's going for piloting. Alright, you know what? This is gonna not be of any use to us for the time being anyway. Oh, it's one of those quick firing ones again, isn't it? Okay. I don't know, we don't need shield, so we'll put it into dodge. At least one of you can uh, get some levels. And now so can the other one. Was it not for the fact that they are dead? Uh, 
Now don't tell me you had hacking for sale. <laughs> oh, good stuff. Can we actually get that if I get rid of the scrap arm? Ah, we can wait on hacking. Six shots, huh? And some dangerous looking crew to boot. But we do have a crystal. He doesn't, he doesn't even care what the hell's going on. Which I can only applaud. Damn right, go fix your shields, because that's clearly the most important part. Goodbye, Steli. I'd say this is going quite well, and not to mention quite quickly. Never did get an answer to the one that uh, came in here, said hello two times. Hmm. Well, I did type a response, so... still kicking. flying through here, aren't we? Anyway, I'm gonna cut it for this episode. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you're still in the series. Feel free, show support by coming, liking, and or something if you haven't already. I'll be seeing you guys on the next episode. Bye, everyone.